Hello Tina, welcome back to this channel, it is Gamesform, and today's video, I'm starting another discussion, this one not as big as the last one, well we got a bunch of like heated debate and whatnot, and this one, I want to discuss what is your guys' favorite experience in Warframe, and what was the, let's say, content that you were playing, and what were you doing in the game, pretty much, right? And why did you enjoy the experience so much? I think it's actually a very interesting topic. Sometimes it gets you into the game, and sometimes it's something that brings you back and makes you enjoy the game again, right? Or well, maybe it's just something you like to hop on Warframe every once in a while and do. Like, honestly, when I first started playing the game, the best experience I had at the beginning was when I found Dink on them when I was streaming on Twitch. And we just did these, like, long survival and defense missions, and I was completely new to the game, so I had no idea what I was doing, right? I was being carried, like, 100%. It, it was pretty bad. But, but I, I was having fun just, like, slaughtering everything, right? For reference, when they found me, I only had Excalibur. So when I actually went and unlocked Rhino for the first time and did that stomp with a bunch of enemies nearby and they're all just floating in the air, that is an experience that you never forget, man. You just go ahead and stop all these guys and they're floating in the air and they have nothing to do and you slot them. It's so good. Like, that is an amazing experience. Also, if you start with Mag, shout out to you, Biz. Mag is actually really fun. But man, those days when I started on Warframe, some of the best. Obviously, you don't have like the best tool sets and whatnot, but it's an enjoyable experience because you have so much to do and so much to like learn about the game. So that was the first enjoyable experience. The second uh, enjoyable experience when I was a little bit more experienced in the game and whatnot was when Deimos came out in like 2019, I believe. I believe it's late 2019 in the summertime around then. And man, I love Deimos. Probably my favorite update in the game. Now, it did have bugs with like Scintillant. And then, the infested blended in with like some of the terrain, obviously, right? So nothing. There's always bugs in Warframe updates, still. So that's to be imagined. But overall, you had vaults, you had bounties, you had the new fish, and all these other things you can go do. And I love the vaults in this game. Also, to top it off, you had the helm of system came in. One of the best systems that can change your Warframe like instantly. You get with a bad ability on a Warframe, get one from a different Warframe that you like. And boy, it seems just the whole setup in a kit that you have to do with that Warframe. It is good. I swear, man. In my opinion, Deimos was the best update they dropped. Oh, expansion, you might say. And also, there wasn't like a long storyline behind it where you're locked into it. You did one tiny quest that took like maybe like 5, 10 minutes out. 3 minutes, depending on how fast you did it. It was pretty easy. And then you get all this stuff to go do. You just go and do it. It's so sweet. You're not locked into it. You can go do whatever you want after that point. And it's enjoyable. And also, all of my friends were playing at that point. They came back, they played that, and they haven't played the last two expansions. So, like, it was an enjoyable expansion. We all win the vault, you know, you get the mechs still. Oh, let me tell you, the mechs that you could go into, so much fun. The mechs all just fun to play, too. There's so much good stuff about Davos, man. We could talk about Davos all day. But that was a really good experience. That first two weeks of that, so good. Actually, I still go back and do vaults to this day. I really enjoy vaults. It's just so good. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Man, this video's been good. He's been talking about Deimos. But you know what we haven't talked about yet? The K-Drives. And I know you guys haven't done your infested K-Drive yet. Some of you are lacking, man. Some of you are lacking. Let's go ahead and look at it. You guys need to go do the races in the demos and get your infested cage drive. You really do. I have a video on it, by the way. It's very simple. If I can do it, you can do it. Because I am a pretty terrible... I made mistakes in the video, too, by the way. So that's right. Those are so that you can do it. But man, cage drive races are insane. And demos has them, too. Gotta love it. With that being said, that was my two favorite experiences in Warframe. Definitely let me know what you guys' favorite experience was. Or multiple experiences if you have that. But overall, if you're not enjoying the game anymore, definitely go back and maybe take a break or go back to just having fun with the game and stuff grinding. The grind can definitely ruin the enjoyment of the game, so definitely don't go too crazy if you're trying to farm out that mastery level or trying to get a certain weapon. Just take your time and have fun. That's really what the game's supposed to be about. But I feel like a lot of people get lost in that and they try grinding it out. Definitely just play the game to have fun. That's the way to do things. I mean, obviously it's a video game. But overall, we all love Warframe. It's amazing. And man, I hope the next expansion's good. Hope you guys have a great day and stay safe with though. I'll catch you guys next time. Gage from out.